Hey, so what's going on guys? Me here with Drug Tech Reviews and welcome back to another video. So I'm back again today with another MacBook Pro 16 inch case. So this fits the latest MacBook Pro 16 inch with the M1 chip. So I was out on the market looking for something, uh, I would say with more value for money and also sturdy and thin and light, a case that is minimalistic. And uh, of course, in most important is the price and also the quality. So I came across this case, which I have right here. So this is a hard shell case, as you can hear from the sound. So this is hard shell case, which actually took the place of the unique venture as my daily driver case for my MacBook Pro 16 inch. So I've been using this case for the last two and a half to three months as my daily case. In fact, this case convinced me to actually sell off the unique venture and just use this case alone. Of course, I do not use my MacBook Pro that heavily and I also use another sleeve. So this case costs 36 ringgit which translates to less than 10 US dollars which is really really cheap. And in my months of actually testing and using this case as a daily case, um, this case has never let me down. But of course, when you do use this case, you're sacrificing a little bit of protection which I will show you guys later. So this case also came with a very nice uh, keyboard protector, very similar to the one that came with the Unique Venture. I believe they are from the same factory because uh, the texture is the same, the quality basically is identical. Let me just take you through this case. So this has a matte translucent exterior, you can see right here. Um, so far the, the grip has been really good, it has never fallen off or anything like that. So the clips are all on the top right here as well as the bottom so the lid side of things has been really really good except that the fact that i do not like the apple cutout uh there are many of you out there that love the apple cutout but for me i do not like it because this is uh extra hole where dust can actually get in and scratch the macbook itself so that's more of a personal preference but i wish they actually just covered it up being a china product you can see there are slits here but you know that the new MacBook M1 series, uh, they do not have vents on the bottom because of how efficient the processor is. These vents are designed after the previous MacBook with the Intel chip. But anyways, it's good to have slits at the bottom. Of course, yes, it does introduce more dust, but so far I haven't experienced any uh, dust getting in because I do use an outer sleeve. But anyways, uh, if you do have vents like this, uh, it will help in the heat dissipation if you are doing uh, graphic intensive work that's when the macbook starts to get a bit warm yeah you can see right here the slits for the speakers on each side uh, nothing obstructed at all so far from my testing sounds just as good as uh, without the case so let me show you around so all the clips are here uh, do not have to worry because the clips do not actually scratch the device because i was initially worried that these clips uh, would actually like scuff up the body of the MacBook but uh, apparently it doesn't so it's a very good thing considering that this costs 36 ringgit I mean yeah it's a real steal in, in my opinion okay so flipping things around this is where I prefer this case over the unique venture so first things first the unique venture was a hybrid case so which means that the rubber stoppers even though they were present they weren't of the most grippiest material but I do like this over that is because this is actually rubber. Of course, it will get worn out in time to come as you would like move it on the table and stuff like that. But the price of this is no brainer to get another set. I mean, if you are the OCD type with the feet, you can actually just get another case, another color or something like that. That will also work out. But it's better than having no grip, just like the Unique Venture. Unique Venture, my laptop was like, sliding around and stuff like that which wasn't safe i didn't feel safe using that case that's the reason why i decided to stick with the cheaper option in fact so if you remember the unique venture they had full coverage on all the edges this does not have so it leaves the back portion of your macbook exposed um i believe that's not a problem for me because i do handle my things with care but uh, if you're scared of like nicking the aluminium frame or aluminium chassis um definitely get one with the protection something like the unique venture but so far so good so far i've been using it it has held up really really well okay now let's test fitment very simple and easy just one click and 
we're basically good to go all right so let's put the bottom side in it's facing the back okay snap in all the corners okay let's do the front side okay here all snapping in really really easy to install okay now let's go for the top portion here's the one i have right here so it's very similar you just have to slot in the back side first here the click and then you just go around clicking in all the the clips so basically that's it that's how simple it is to put on this case and on top of that it doesn't come out so it's a win-win situation easy to install easy to take out but at the same time it doesn't just fall out the reason i'm doing this video is because i believe this is the best value for money you, you cannot find a cheaper version of this case that uh, provides this amount of protection as well as how sleek and slim the design is i mean this is no brainer all right so i will leave the link in the description below if you're interested to pick one of these cases up of course if you do want more protection go with the unique venture or some other more protective case but if you're looking something thin and light especially on the 16 inch monstrosity right here definitely this case is a very very good case to go along with your 16 inch macbook and it does not put stress on the hinge because it is very thin and light all right guys so this has been a really quick video hope you guys like this video if you did like it do give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to this channel for more content just like this one and i'll catch you guys in the next video